We are just four days away from the Chiefs and Bucks going head to head down in Tampa for Super Bowl 55 for KC. They don't necessarily come into this game at full strength. I want to bring in Rob Collins, who is down in Tampa ahead of the big game. Now, Rob, we saw Eric Fisher go down with that Achilles injury in the AFC Championship game. He obviously won't play. Now, Big Red basically has had to use scotch tape to hold that unit together, and now they have to go up against that Bucks defensive line with some former all pros. Yeah, a tough chore for the Chiefs offensive line going to get it up that formidable front seven for Tampa Bay. And you mentioned it, the Chiefs had to deal with offensive line issues all season long with opt outs early in the season, then Mitchell Schwartz getting hurt. And then, of course, Eric Fisher not playing today. So that's going to fall on uh, Wisniewski, going to fall on Rimmers, going to fall on uh, Ryder and Allegretti and those guys to give Patrick Mahomes protection to run the offense. You know, the Chiefs like to run a lot of RPOs. We also know they like long developing plays like Walter been last year's Super Bowl, right? So Coach Reed obviously knows the offensive line will be a big key in this game. The Chiefs look to cap off their run it back tour on Sunday in Super Bowl 55 against the Tampa Bay Buccaneers with a W. I want to bring in Rob Collins, who's made his way down to Tampa ahead of the big game. Now, Rob, Chiefs quarterback Patrick Mahomes maneuvered through concussion protocol last week in time to go out and help beat the Bills in the AFC Championship game. But he's still dealing with that toe injury. How might that impact his play against the Bucs? Yeah, the turf toe is impacting him a little bit, as we saw in the Buffalo Bills game. But it looks like this weekend he should be good to go. And speaking of the weekend, they're practicing right behind us here at Raymond James Stadium. Now, don't get your hopes up. I don't think the weekend is in there right now. They're just working on the, uh, the light show, maybe some pyrotechnics here in a minute. But Mahomes certainly looks to supply some fireworks coming up on Sunday inside that Raymond James Stadium against the Bucks in the Super Bowl. And his mobility, a big factor with that toe. We know Andy Reid loves to run those RPOs. So Mahomes' mobility may be an issue or it may not. Here's QB1 on how that toe feels it feels a lot better uh, i mean having these two weeks to, to let it rest and heal up um especially being almost three weeks away from the uh, over three weeks away from the uh the injury itself uh, i mean if you look at, at those type of in injuries that kind of gives you the the normal timeline so uh definitely every single day that i get the rest it, it makes it even better um but it, it's it's pretty close to 100 percent well, Super Bowl week in 2021 has been much different than 2020 for the Kansas City Chiefs due to the COVID-19 pandemic. But when they hit the field on Sunday, that will all change. You know, I want to bring in Rob Collins, who's down in Tampa ahead of the big game. Rob, you and I have talked about this week about the Chiefs' knack for running those RPOs. But it always seems that Big Red and company have a play or two up their sleeves that nobody is ever really ready for. Yeah, certainly one thing not different in this COVID season is the fact that Andy Reid will go deep into his playbook in the biggest games, right? We saw it last year when they did the Rose Bowl parade, when everybody did the little spin and they tried to get the first down there inside the five-yard line. But the Chiefs are a fun bunch of guys, and Andy Reid actually tells his guys to, hey, if you got a play idea or as assistant coaches, let me know about it. We might implement them. We saw that in Vegas when they ran the roulette play. So Travis Kelsey, Patrick Mahomes, Tyreek Hill all having fun with it, and Coach Andy Reid's says he's trying to stay young by keeping the fun in the trick place. We try to have fun with it the best we can, and everybody contributes. I've got uh, some really good coaches, assistant coaches. I, you guys know that. I've got players that have chipped in on plays, and uh, they, they, just, they have a blast with it. 